Now, uh, the concerning the uh, poll taken by Newsweek magazine, I think you said that this was the leaders who said that, uh, who went with King and against Mr. Muhammad around 90%. I just told you a little while ago, these leaders that they call leaders, this included <laughs> Lena Horne, this included Dick Gregory, and this included comedians, comics, trumpet players, baseball players. Show me in the white community where a comedian is a white leader. Show me in the white community where a singer is a white leader, or a dancer or a trumpet player is a white leader. These aren't leaders. These are puppets and clowns that uh, have been set up over the white community and or over the black community by the white community and have been made celebrities and usually say exactly what uh, they know that the white man wants to hear. You'll find that oftentimes Negroes are as much on guard uh, around Negro interviewers who usually represent the bourgeois uh, element of Negroes as they are on guard around whites. Uh, usually Negroes know that when this bourgeois Negro walks through the door, he is not doing something that he's initiated himself, but he's involved in something in which the white man is the absolute author of and has sent him to the Negro community for some information. And when they give that Negro some information, usually they give him the information that they want the white want him to take back to the white man because that's who he's going to take it back to. Four more minutes. 